गाइस माय नेम इज अंकुश कौरव एंड आई वेलकम यू टू कॉन टू सीरीज इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल वी गन लर्न समथिंग कॉल्ड एज इंटरनेशनलाइजेशन एंड लोकलाइजेशन विद द हेल्प ऑफ सम ऑफ द कॉन्सेप्ट्स व्हिच यू हैव ऑलरेडी लर्न इन द प्रीवियस ट्यूटोरियल्स लाइक एन इंटरसेप्टर कॉन्सेप्ट स्प्रिंग मैसेज सोर्स एंड सम मोर द प्रोसेस ऑफ क्रिएटिंग or developing a web application in such a generic manner that it can handle or support more than one language is known as an internationalization process in such a generic web application when you add a new language support you say you are localizing your web application for that language guys this is a kind of very abstract definition i've given over here let me explain these terms in a detailed way with the help of a very simple requirement which i have in this demo application so let's start at present this whole demo application is hardwired in english means it's all in english language now what if 50% of visitors of this demo application want to view this web page in english and remaining 50% in french so what i would do in such a situation to tackle such a requirement what i do i would simply support french as well in this web application in addition to english so whoever wants to view this web page in english i would show content of this web page in english and whoever wants to view this web page in french for them i would show its content in french language now big question is what does i need to perform to make this application support one more language and that is french guys most of the things we have already done in the previous tutorials to make this application support multiple languages you remember we included a properties file with the name student messages dot properties in the previous tutorials after putting message source pin here in the spring configuration file guys this is the only concept or thing we would need to fulfill the specific requirement which we have in this demo in just a couple of moments i would show you how guys this is a uh, this jsp page for which we want to support french as well as english means two languages if you observe here in this jsp file all labels are hardwired in english so first task that i'm going to do here is i would put place holders for all these labels one by one and put the corresponding values in this properties file that is student messages dot properties so let's start replacing all labels with the corresponding place holders for this jsp file for students name label i have here replaced it with label dot student name place holder now let's put this place holders value here in this properties file as well cool in the similar manner let's replace other labels too with the corresponding place holders guys i've already done it just to save some time so here i have replaced all labels with the corresponding place holders now let's put these labels matching values in this properties file as well cool so here i'm done with replacing all hardwired english labels with their corresponding place holders and have put all matching place holders values in this properties file now let's test it on the browser cool after this change server has sent me this response for this url but this time all these labels values are actually not coming from this jsp file straight forward but are coming from this properties file guys okay, since this properties file is containing all key value pairs you know which is supporting english language so i'm going to replace its name with the student messages underscore en dot properties cool guys okay, after this change now this application is able to support multiple languages for this jsp file to support french language all i need to do is include a new properties file in this folder you know the way we added student messages underscore en for english we need to add 
a properties file with the name student messages underscore fr dot properties for French language and that's it. So let me include a properties file here. Cool. Now let's copy all these placeholders here. Now we go to replace these placeholders English values with the matching French values. So just to save some time, I've already done it. Cool. So here I have replaced all English values with the matching French values. So now we have two properties file in this demo application one student messages underscore en and other one student messages underscore fr is after this change now this application supports two languages and that is French and English for this GSP file let's test this on the browser Yes, every browser has a language preference setting feature provided in it for example in Chrome a user can provide his preference about what language he prefers over other languages while viewing the web pages. For example, in Chrome, this setting has been provided here. Go to settings, and then go to languages and input settings. Here, if user has uh, provided French as the preferred language over English then the content of the web page would be shown in French and if he has provided English as the preferred language over French then the content of the web page would be shown in English language so in this tutorial, we learned how to support multiple languages in a Spring MVC web application for any JSP file. In the next tutorial, we can learn some more advanced features related to internationalization and localization. Guys, a big thank you for learning Spring MVC with me. If you have any feedback or comments, please provide them below the video or send me an email on this email ID for all of your queries. Please hit the like button if you really like this video and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel Gone to Series and I'm gonna catch you in the next part of this tutorial.